All right, welcome everybody. This is 2014 Panini Prism. We're just doing uh, six boxes tonight. Um, this is our third Panini break on Card World. Um, we uh, did sell all the teams. Thanks everybody for hopping in and helping me fill this out, um, both on eBay and direct. Um, I appreciate it. Um, I know we don't break a whole lot on Saturday, but didn't have any other time this week. I'm going to go through the teams. Um, and uh, I'll go through the teams real quick, and um, and uh, um, and the uh, and the team and the owners. I'm sorry, real quick, and we'll go through it. Uh, we got the Arizona Cardinals with Chad Kramer, uh, Alex as the Atlanta Falcons, uh, Baltimore is let's see, Healy forty. You know, Healy, I was planning on keeping the, the full base for the rookies, but if you want some of them, I'll, like, split them with you. The price actually was was actually without the base. It was just for the parallels and the, and the uh, hits. But if you want some rookies, man, um, just let me know. We'll work it out. I'm uh, I'm uh, pretty flexible. Um, Healy, $44.99 on the Ravens. Dennis has the Buffalo Bills. Jeff G was for the Panthers. Alex is for the Bears. Scott Stacy for the Bengals. Indians Fandom has the Browns. CMSC Master was for the Cowboys. Mark M has the Broncos. Kevin has the Detroit Lions. C. Wheeler has the Packers. Brent has the Houston Texans. Mark M has the Indianapolis Colts. Kev, uh, um, I almost did it again. John has the Jaguars. Uh, Healy has the Chiefs. R.I. Ron has the Miami Dolphins. Zamil has the Vikings. Dustin Lee has the Patriots. Dave has the uh, Saints. Freddie has the Giants. Um, Healy has the New York Jets. Um, uh, Zamil has the Oakland Raiders. Healy has the Eagles. Pittsburgh is Wildcat. Uh, San Diego is Healy. Um, San Francisco is Zamil. Seattle is Freddie. Um, St. Louis uh, Rams is Healy. Freddie has the Bucks. Dave has the Titans. And Healy has the Redskins. Healy has the last seven teams for the hits and the parallels and whatever whatever rookies he wants. You just let me know. Um, Healy, uh, send me an email sometime this break at that same email address, and I'll send you an email later, and you, we can work it out. That way I have your email on file anyways, I can put you on my break mailing list, which a lot of these people buy on. There it is again. Other than that, I'm ready to open, unless I got a team wrong. I don't think I did. Nope. Let's do this. Oh, I had both box cutters back there. I'll be right back. This product has variations too. You'd get any of those, of course. I never include variations in base when I uh, ever sell to anybody, which I do once in a while without the base. Variations are considered a hit to me in my head. Box number one. I think they have one variation per box in this is what it is. Cool. Get this down on the packs. Good luck, everybody. We opened the first six boxes about nine days ago, I think. Had a busy week this week with other stuff, so we didn't really get a chance at it. Next week, got a really busy week, too. Uh, Tuesday and Wednesday, I'm doing Bowman Chrome Jumbo Baseball. I really sold the heck out of the teams already. I dropped the team's prices today, and 
I think I sold 15 teams in the first five minutes, so a little more demand than that than I thought. I probably should have been doing more Bowman Chrome. I didn't realize uh, there was still that much interest. Bowman, we did the heck out of it. I mean, we opened uh, 30 Bowman cases, but Bowman Chrome, I usually don't do as much. I got a good deal on this case, though, so I was able to charge less for the uh, the team spots than on eBay. And then the rest of the week next week, I'll probably do six box a six box Valor case on Thursday, and I might do it the same day as a flawless box. I have one or two flawless boxes coming next week. I wasn't sure if I was going to do a hit draft with like 10 spots or if I was just going to sell the team spots like normal. Just making sure everybody knew that in a box of flawless you only get 10 cards. So it's a little bit more of a gamble product, but boy, there, there are some big cards in it. Some nice cards. If you hit a card, you're doing well, that's for sure. Unless it's a base card and you got one of the big teams. But I figured the people that buy been buying football breaks from me all year, same team over and over, I'd give them a shot at the Flawless, too. Um, so we'll see. I'll do that probably Thursday. And then Friday, i got Top Supreme Football, or I'll do the opposite. Some sort of order like that. Not Supreme Football, Supreme Baseball. Lead it off. Oh, we got an autograph right at the start. Second card's an auto. We got Mike Evans right at the start. It kind of looks like the variation, but I'm not sure if it is. First auto is a rookie auto. Oh, Washington Redskins. One of the last teams starts it off. Seastrunk. That's a red parallel auto. I forgot no Jason today. I need to grab my sleeves and top loaders. It's numbered out of 75. Nice start for you. I'll show it again after I get it in the top loader. Seastrunk. Number three of 75. Like always on this prism, after the break, I'll sleeve every card in here. I always sleeve all the chrome and prism cards to avoid scratches in that. Here it is, though. Three of 75. Teddy Bridgewater insert. Nice die cut of Bridgewater. The Panini parallel with the gold on the side of Greg Robinson for the Rams. Mike Glennon die cut. Oh, the sea struck. Washington Redson, sea struck. See it right there? It's focusing for mine at least. Redskins. Lache, I think his first name is. L A C H E. But a parallel of Rashid Jennings for the Giants. Those aren't numbered. Those are the Panini gold on the side. Refractor Carson Palmer.
Tom Brady refractor. All cards sleeved and all cards shipped out unless I make some other uh, agreement with you. Anquan Bolden hands team for the Giants. Darrell Revis parallel, red parallel for the Patriots out of 125. Peyton Manning die cut. And we got the second auto right away. This looks like the Steelers coming up. I saw it on the corner. Ryan Sh Shazer. Shazier. It's a pretty popular Steeler for rookies. These prisms uh, go in and out of focus a lot when they're a refractor one. It's easier when they're the top loader. That's numbered out of 350. I think he played at Ohio State. Yeah, I remember him at Ohio State. Boy, they go in and out with this. That's Wildcat, but on eBay. For the Steelers. Die cut Steven Jackson. Steven Tewitt, orange parallel for the Steelers. Die cut Odell Beckham Jr. There is inserts in this. I don't know why I wasn't thinking there was inserts. Dan Marino, golden red. That Marino, I don't think... I should, those are not numbered. It is a nice parallel, though, for the Dolphins. Marquise Lee insert for the Jags. Green and gold parallel. Tom Bali for the Chiefs. You get two autos per box, but once in a while we got three. But there's two autos per box is what they say. But we've gotten three once in a while on it. We're almost done with this one, though. We've got two. Uh, Prism. These are neat parallels. For the Arizona Cardinals, Andre Ellington. All kinds of shine on those. Number 38 of 99 for Chad. Second Teddy Bridgewater die cut for Zamil. Two Bridgewater inserts. Zamil, we got to hit you a Bridgewater auto in here. Even though that would probably kill Jason since he had the first six. Now we have a third auto. These are only two autos per box, I'm pretty sure, but we got a third one here. Good luck, everybody. For the Jaguars, Chris Smith. I think this one is probably numbered because it's the gold panini. 75. I don't know. You Jags fans can probably tell me if Chris Smith's uh, on the team uh, still or not. Looks like he's defensive. Number 55 is 75. Yeah, yes. Good. You know, I know some of these guys that they put in the sets, uh, lesser names are already gone, but usually the defensive guys aren't because they usually were a decent pick if they have an autograph in the set. It's usually the quarterbacks, you know, like Taj Boyd that are gone and still in the sets. Refractor intro of Frank Gore. And last pack, got a Oakland Raider, Derek Carr. 
I'm getting you inserts of Emil so far, but not the hits. Kyle Rudolph parallel for the Vikes. And that is one of six boxes. Three autos in that. I do like these prism. I think when uh, down the road for car for football cards, in a year or two, Topps basically it looks like is going to lose its football license, and Panini is going to be exclusive unless something changes. I think this Prism product over time is going to uh, develop into one of their better products because it has a lot of color. It's it's a little more fun to do, and it's at a price point that's pretty reasonable. It's not a hundred dollars. For a box. Hey, Shem. Uh, nothing monstrous. We got three autos in the first box. We got a Jaguar Gold uh, to 75. Uh, Steelers, Shazir, and Seastrunk for the Washington Redskins to 125. I don't, and yes, I don't think they have. Anything other than the Panini points cards. They do have redemptions in some Panini products for certain players still. But in this, I have, we've never had a redemption, have we? I don't know if we've ever had a redemption in this. Maybe we have and I'm forgetting it. But they have those Panini points cards. Yep. Titans and Saints, uh, Dave. We've been hitting Sankey pretty decent, and Brandon Cook, so uh, you got a shot. And Chrome, I had you for the Indians and Padres, too, what you said. I was telling Dave, uh, I thought Bowman, you know, Bowman Chrome, I thought it, I was surprised how fast I sold teams tonight. Middle of football season, yet we still get the prospecting a little bit in baseball, you know. It's fun to do. Bowman Chrome's going to be fun. A Bowman Chrome draft's going to be fun. I think that's going to be a, a pretty good product. Yeah, it's kind of it's kind of surprising because in the Raz rooms, you know, I mean, you're in there a lot. They, they really downplay Chrome a lot, and they kind of talk it down, but yet it still moves just about as good as anything else. Part of the reason why is just overall there's a lot of different products. Always during football season, there's there's a lot of inventory out there because you got all the – I mean, there's basketball, football, and baseball going on right now. Early in the year when you just have Bowman and there's no football, that's why that's hotter at that point. Plus, it doesn't hurt early in the year, too, and people get tax returns back and stuff. That adds a little money, I think, to the uh, sports card hobby sometimes, in my experience. Got a clowny insert from the Texans. Orange parallel Kyle Fuller. I think some of those guys, Dave, um, in Chrome Baseball, that were that have been slow, like you know, that gone down, like Mookie Betts and even Abreu in that. I think they're going to heat up a lot in spring training next year. I really do. Oh, Cam Newton, that's what I meant to show. Cam Newton. I think Mookie Betts is going to be pretty hot in spring training as long as he's still on the Red Sox. Reggie Bush refractor. For Kevin, I didn't even see if Kevin was in here tonight or not. Kevin's in here. You're being quiet. You're usually yelling at me by now. Dallas Cowboys, Roger Staubach. Nice Staubach parallel for Dallas. Dallas is hot right now. Selling the Dallas team sets well. Golden Green. Hey, Kevin, how you doing? Golden Green of Kurt Warner.
Kaepernick insert. <laughs> right. Freddie's attention Freddie's attention got brought up because I said Mookie. <laughs> I just hit you an auto two breaks ago. You mean football auto. <laughs> Michael Floyd Red. And he was a Hall of Famer. That's worth two autos. Any Hall of Famers worth two autos. Eddie Lacy insert for the pack. And Cam Newton insert. <laughs> Football's the strikeout one. Is Ebron signing anything or what? Are we just missing him? Lewis Nix. Golden Green. All right, we got a duel. We got Bears on one side and Cowboys on the other. I will random many of these duels real quick afterwards. That's Emmett and Walter. Greatest of all time running backs. I'd rather hit you a Barry anyways. Matt Ryan. I know I hit you a non-sports auto because I still remember the Snoop Dogg auto. Ginter was better for you than football. Oh. Got a cool veteran auto coming up and it popped right up at me. Got a veteran auto coming up. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Patterson. CPAT. Samil, don't tell Jason. Nice auto for your Viking spot. I'll sleeve it and show it again in the top loader. Wow. You'll love the numbers, Emil. Samil, you got the Vikings, right? Yeah. I've made that mistake before, congratulating somebody that didn't actually have the team. Don't tell Jason, Emil. He almost had he almost took the Vikes because he had him in the first six. <laughs> no. I mean, he'll be happy for you. I'm just teasing. Number four of ten. Four of ten. Very low numbered. That's a nice one. CPAT's had a hard time getting the ball this year, man, but he's he's talented. He's talented. That's that's he's gonna play for a while, I think. Garoppolo refractor. Him and Bridgewater get on the same path and they get some experience. Cole Pepper refractor. I was surprised to see it out of 10. I thought those were out of 50. For the Bears, Alshon Jeffrey. Parallel. This the prism, all sort of prism. Jets, Chris Johnson. That's 57 out of 99. Are you a Viking fan, Ely? We got a lot of Viking fans around here. Jordy Nelson. I have a good friend that lives next door that is a full-fledged Viking fan. He was there. Uh, he was a ball boy as a kid and got the Viking tattoo and everything. I hear about it every week. Devonta Adams. He sticks with them, but he likes Bridgewater. 
but he, he complains about the offensive line about every 20 minutes. We got Freddie's favorite, Planini points. We'll uh, figure out something with those later. We usually do something. If I get two of them, I'll do one for the hitless teams and one for all the teams. If I get one, then I'll just do one for all the teams. So that one will be random off to all 32 teams. Yeah, they've had uh, they've had their issues, man. Box number three. Khalil was the second pick in the draft, and he seems like he's really underperforming for the second pick in the draft. When you're the second pick of the draft, <laughs> kids are watching. <laughs> when you're the second pick in the draft, you should be uh, you should be um, you should be near an all-pro right away. If you're if you're a tackle, pick second. I mean, that's the second pick in the draft. All right, box three. We only had one autograph in that box. Oh, no, we had two. We had the Penoids card. So we've had five. <laughs> I hear about Khalil about every week. Of course, their whole line has struggled. McKinnon's been a nice surprise since AP uh, uh, jumped ship, got booted, however you want to phrase it. I don't know if McKinnon is, uh, yeah, the, the Panini points are their, their redemption cards for an autograph. You put them on, online, you can actually get an auto for the points. It's kind of lame, but that's how they do the redemptions now. Now, I've heard if it's a better player, they actually have those redemptions in it. McKinnon was really good in college. He just played at a smaller uh, school, so flew under the radar. loves the Panini points. I have a feeling they may drop that program after a year or two. I was talking to somebody about it that worked at Panini in the past this last week, and I told them, I'm like, honestly, you're just better off doing the redemption and making people wait. People like to have a name on a card. Instant gratification. Let's hit another good name. That was a good box of cards with CPAT. First box wasn't too bad. Nice card for the Browns. Johnny Manziel insert. Fresh faces. Autograph number one. I get an autograph right on the first pack every time. Got Storm Johnson blocking for an auto of Terrence West. The Cleveland Browns. West has got some potential in Cleveland. Running back for Cleveland. He's been playing on and off. Santana Moss Refractor. That might be Sammy's variation. I'm not sure. I'll know later when I go through the teams. Ray Lewis, insert.
Antonio Andrews, orange, and a parallel of Earl Campbell. Campbell goes to the Tennessee Titans, since that's what Houston used to be. Nice card of Earl Campbell. That's not numbered, though. Die cut, Buffalo Bills, Sammy Watkins. Class rings. Nice parallel here for the Patriots. Tom Brady. Brady has crazy career win-loss record. Reggie Wayne parallel for the Colts. Jason Witten. Red and gold. Non-numbered. Not numbered. Got a clowny die cut for the Texans. I think that's the second clowny insert. Justin Gilbert parallel for the Browns. Number to 125 for Justin Gilbert. Refractor for the Browns. Refractor rookie. Uh, they're not called refractors, I know, but they're called prisms. Johnny Manziel. Parallel card. Second Browns card of this box. Or better Browns cards. Got a Manziel rookie right behind it. Larry Fitzgerald insert hands team. Kansas City Chiefs parallel number 16 of 99. Derek Johnson. Jordan Matthews die cut. Small stack left in box number three. Should have a hit. Yep, we got an autograph coming right up. Just one. Autograph right behind Stephen Tuitt is for the Carolina Panthers. If we could focus, I can see the name. I think that's that Coney. Coney Ely, E-A-L-Y. I know we've had his auto before. Coney Ely. For the Carolina Panthers. Carolina is Jeff. Demarius Thomas, orange, right there for the Denver Broncos. Nice parallel of Thomas. And another Denver Broncos. This is the Prism hands team, Wes Welker. Yeah, they have a range of rookies. It's not all the top guys in here. Of course, top says the same thing, pretty much. Jeremy Hill for the Bengals. Nice parallel there for Zamil. Oh, the writing. Yeah, I agree with that also. <laughs> Teddy Bridgewater for Zamil. That's not numbered Zamil. It's the uh, Panini Gold where it has the Panini symbol on the side. Yeah, that doesn't take a whole lot of work to do that, does it? 
I think it's I think it's more laziness than anything. You get a hundred thousand or not a hundred thousand. You get five thousand stickers in front of you, and you're like, ah. Uh, I mean, some of them are baseball are just horrible. Will Myers sent, all did all his rookie ones with like one letter. Cam Newton insert. Matt McPherson in baseball would just write mad on a bunch of them. No, Zamil, that was it's the um, uh, it's the the Panini parallels where it's gold on the side and says Panini is not numbered on the back. You get a few of them per box. Still a nice looking parallel, but it's not numbered. The pure golds are out of ten. Those are really hard to get. We got one in the last case, though. I'm not sure if we got one in the first six or not. Box number four. That's why, uh, speaking back on that autograph subject, that's why I never gave Marquise Goodwin a hard time last year when his autographs, his autographs were just ugly as heck, but they were all over the place. I'd rather have somebody have a really big scribble than just a tiny little dot. At least they're spending some time signing it, even if it does look like a third grader did it. When they like initial, that's the worst. Or write one name. You know, CPAT was selling really good for me at the start of the year. I mean, really good, but he slowed down a little bit for me uh, be just because of uh, getting him the ball, you know, at Minnesota, but. In the wrapper rooms around here, he went phenomenal at the start of the year. Uh, Freddie, who's in the room tonight, had a one of one of them at the start of the year. I can't remember what he get. What did you get for that? He had a one of one out of, uh, I want to say five, a museum maybe? It was the Vikings, uh, the Viking head symbol, I think. And he sold it. He did a good job of selling it at the right time. He really did. Because he got a lot for it. Didn't he get like 50 per Dave or something like that? I thought he got like four or 500 for it. Alright, box number four. I agree. There's definite upside there. Second parallel for Dan Marino for the Dolphins owner. This one is numbered 47 of 125 of Marino. I should be pulling the numbered ones for the recap. I will do a recap at the end. Working alone tonight, so I don't have Jason sleeving these behind me. Russell Wilson die cut. He actually had pretty good timing on that one. All right, we got an autograph here. He's working. Good luck. We got a backwards Dante Moncrief blocking an auto. Looking like a little red. Of Green Bay Packers. Jeff Janus. For the pack. Don't know Jeff. Number 75 of 75. 
Green Bay was bought on eBay. C. Wilder. 75 out of 75. Let's keep going here. AJ McCarron, refractor there for Scott. Percy or Pierre Garçon, insert hands team for the Redskins. <laughs> That's baseball. That's Seattle. Here's a nice parallel card for Cleveland. This guy uh, doesn't have that many cards. Isaiah Kroll, green and gold. He's raw anus, that's right. <laughs> Cody Latimer for the Broncos insert. Another Bridgewater insert. We're doubling up on those. Oh, there is an auto. Auto number two for this box. Jets. J-E-T-S Jets. Autograph of uh, Focus, so I can read it. Trevor Riley. Trevor Riley. Rookie Auto. Trevor Riley. Ooh, that is number to 50. Didn't think that was numbered so low. From Utah. Six of fifty. Demarius Thomas. Insert for the Broncos. Hands team, Wes Walker. Orange Refractor, Chris Carter, Orange Prism, I should say. Those are not numbered. Getting a lot of Viking parallels and inserts in this uh, group. This one might be one that Kevin doesn't have yet. It's a green and gold parallel. Not numbered, but it's the green and gold of Calvin Johnson. Calvin going to play this weekend? Marius Thomas, Refractor. John Riggins, Gold and Red. I got a nice card for Atlanta coming up. Elshon Jeffrey, Prism. And then Atlanta, it's not an auto, but it's a tough parallel. Matt Ryan. Now, this is the tie-dye parallel. It's nice looking. It, it's really nice in person. And it's number three. Just missed his jersey number. Just missed it. Three of 25. Atlanta is Alex. So, nice card there for Alex. I normally ship... Um, it just depends on who you are. Like yours, I'll send Monday. Well, almost all of these actually I'll send Monday. If it's during the week and I know you want to combine with other items, I hold it until the combine's done. But, like, for your stuff, it will get shipped Monday. The only time I hold it is basically when people want to save money on shipping, which is, is quite often, actually, with a lot of people. Robert Griffin. Insert. Derek Carr, insert. A green and gold parallel of Jimmy Graham. 
Those are not numbered, I don't believe. Nope. Jake Matthews. Prism. Cincinnati Bengals insert, A.J. McCarron. Hold on one second. Last group of box four. We have the AJ McCarron insert. Got a Colts parallel. Reggie Wayne. That's the prisms. 69 of 99. That's not the prism. What is that called? They're nice looking. Not sure what the name is, the ones to 99. And Kyle Rudolph. Box number five. Oh, that you got to buy next week, Kevin. Yeah, they will probably won't play him then. I got a nice rookie of him that I want to sell, and he's cold right now. He's not necessarily cold, but man, it's it's hard to sell anybody why they're hurt. I don't care if it's one game or five games. It is really difficult to sell somebody when they're hurt. It's not even a major injury, you know, but... I have one of his rookie four-piece four autos that I won in the Raz room. And he got hurt right after it. card in here. No. Just extra cards, I think. Pack was thick. Oh, this, this pack has like one card in it. This one. These cards, I'm good thing it's a full box. Some cards have two, pa some cards, uh, packs have two, and some have six. Another parallel of 25 coming up. Okay, box five. Got a parallel to 99 for the Houston Texans of C.J. Fedorowicz. Peyton Manning. Die cut. For the Broncos. All right, got an autograph here. Auto number one in box number five. That is for the Dallas Cowboys. The Damian Washington. And Washington is numbered 244 of 350. For Dallas.
These have uh, one variation per box. I'll make sure I catch all the variations and I'll sleeve and top load them when I send them out. I can't always tell because the variation is just different with the photos different. But when I sleeve them and sort them, I can pick up on it. Sammy Watkins insert. Vikings Orange Parallel, David Yankee. Mike Glennon, die cut. Jerome Bettis parallel, not numbered for the Steelers. Darius Moore, refractor. Or prism. It's hard for me not to say refractor. Chrome's not too far away. Okay, Tom Ali Prism. And then the, another tie dye. We got two of them. This is the second one for the Cleveland Browns. Number to 25 of Paul Warfield. I think Warfield's a Hall of Famer for the Browns. I'm not sure if he's in the Hall of Fame or not. I thought he was. Number 11 of 25. Nice card here for the Cowboys. Number 64 of 75 of Joseph Randall. Parallel card. Oops. Autograph. This is a red prism of Aaron. Donald for the St. Louis Rams. Aaron Donald for the Rams. Rams have a lot of hits in these products. Very low number. I'll show the number in a second. Not as low as CPAP, but still low. 31 of 35. Orange parallel for the Saints, Drew Brees. Aaron Murray for the Chiefs insert. Allen Robinson, Golden Red. Still have the same deal on Valor Football if anybody's interested in the box afterwards. I can always line up a box too. Insert, refractor insert, prism insert, Eric Ebron for the Lions. Blake Bortles for the Jaguars. Die cut. Green and gold, Jake Locker. Not numbered for the Titans. And I, I definitely hit a Sammy Watkins variation in this because that's a different picture of Sammy Watkins than in the first box. So I think Dennis has Buffalo. I definitely have a Sammy Watkins variation. It's either that one or the other one. Prism, Teddy Bridgewater. Intro is James Lar Laranitis for the Rams. Intro is Ray Lewis.
One box left. Sorry for the quick break. Just had an email for whether if I was live or not. Okay. Box number six. Hey Alex, um, I know I called your name once. I'm trying to think of what it was. Oh, you had a uh, not an auto, Alex, but you had a nice Falcons card, a Matt Ryan out of 25. Tie dye parallel, number three of 25 on that. Uh, no auto Falcon. Um, other team was the Bears, I think. Um, I know you probably had a few small parallels in this and that, but I don't think any autos of the uh, of the Bears. The best card in the break for sure was CPAT Auto number to ten. You know, we have. I'm going to go through the recap in just one second. There's a couple other decent autos, but most of the other autos have been pretty smaller autos. We got a box left here, though. Hopefully, we can hit a couple good autos out of this one. Okay, box number six, green and gold parallel of Devon Street for the Cowboys. You flying away there, Dave? Is that what happened to, De oh no, Freddie's having date night, that's right. Derek Carr for Oakland Raiders. Julian Edelman, green and gold. Bishop Sankey, prism. <laughs> New England Patriots. Now these are numbered. They have the these these are I think one of the nicer parallels. They got the team name in the refractor on the side. It's kind of a neat idea. That is Jimmy Garoppolo for the Patriots. And that is number 49 out of 50. I think they're called NFL Shield. Intros, Cam Newton.
number 34 of 99 for New England Patriots, Darrell Rebus. Dyke cut Blake Bortles. Golden red, not numbered, Cam Newton. Got an auto here. Got a Viking symbol peeking out there as a meal. It's a Viking. Good luck. Scott Crichton. There's your uh, initials I was talking about. Scott Crichton. Not the auto he was looking for. Number 72, Scott, with a S and a C. Exactly. Number 53 out of 100. In case you're writing them down, Zamil. Yeah, it doesn't want to focus. It's 53 out of 100. There it is. Oops, started putting my insert mail. That's alright. I gotta sleep them all afterwards anyways, it doesn't really matter. For Tampa, green and gold parallel of Mike Evans. Hey, what's the score tonight, Zamil? I haven't had a scoring update for baseball. Is the game over? It's a nice Gale Sears card. I can't believe I forgot about the game. It's 10 o'clock here. It's probably over with, isn't it? Demarius Thomas insert. I know Bumgarner pitches tomorrow. Bernard Orange. Clowny die cut. Prism, Brian Hoyer for Cleveland. Frank Gifford, Prism, and a CPAT, Orange. Believe the Hype, Sammy Watkins. And the last group of the six box break. Thanks again for everybody for uh, joining. I do have a few boxes that I can sell if anybody's interested with or without the base. Dep price depends on it. Eddie Lacy. Red Prism, number 13 of 125. Nice card there for the Packers. Tom Brady, Tom Brady, oh, we got one auto left, one auto left, Darquise Denard for the Cincinnati Bengals. Thought I forgot you, Scott, but I got you a small auto at the end. Darquise Denard. <laughs> it, that can't be exact, Kevin. It's got to be like 0 for 23 or something. I can't see it being 101. <laughs> Let me finish up here. Peyton Manning, die cut. Colin Kaepernick. 
<laughs> and that's that for the six boxes of Prism. I'll do a quick recap here, everybody. And all I did have to do with a random for the Panini points, too. If you guys want to stick around, I'll do that. And then I will, uh, if anybody wants a box, I'll open up a box for them. If not, then I'll just leave and sort for the rest of the night. Let me sort these up a little bit, though. I had to do one random for a card, too. We got one die cut that was dual. Was it the Bears and the uh, Cowboys, maybe? I'll find that and do that also. It was Walter and somebody else. Who was with Walter on that? Maybe one of you guys remember. It was either Barry or Emmett, I think. Was it Dallas? Okay, thank you. So I'll, I'll do uh, a random there between Dallas and the Bears also. Okay, this was 2014 Panini Prism break number three. Six bucks. We got several numbered cards, but uh, I just I top-loaded a few of them. I'm working alone tonight, so I didn't get them all for the recap. Uh, we, we did get a couple of Marino parallels for the Dolphins fan. A few other decent ones. We did Jimmy Garoppolo out of 50. Eddie Lacy out of 125. Matt Ryan out of 25. Thanks a lot, Alex. Paul Warfield for the Browns out of 25. Darquis Dernard, rookie auto. Uh, Lache Seastrunk. No. For the Redskins. Cat wants to join the recap. Ryan Shazier. Gold for the Jags of Chris Smith. I'll do that one last. Terrence West. Back up. Coney Early. Sorry, sweetie. I know you're dying for love. Jane, Jeff Janus. Trevor Riley. Aaron Donald. This was out of 35. 31 out of 35 for Aaron Donald Red. That Riley was number 6 of 50. The Janus was out of 75. Sorry, I didn't get the numbers on those. The Coney Early was out of 50. And the Terrence West was not numbered. Ladanian Washington. That is out of 350. Scott Crichton for the Vikings. Out of 100. And the last auto was CPAT. Numbered out of 10. Okay, I'll uh, random off those two randoms real quick. One second. Give me a break. Sorry, sorry, sweetie. Sorry. Set up by random real quick. Thanks, Scott. Appreciate it. Got a full week next week for breaks. A lot of good, a lot of fun. So I did send out the prices for Bowman Chrome Jumbo Baseball today. So if you didn't get those and you need a price of the teams left, let me know. I'll look at it for you in just seconds, Emil. I didn't really look at it that closely the first time. Let's see. Chicago and Dallas. On these uh, smaller and the giveaway randoms, we always go three times. So we will go three times on these two randoms.
Only one Panini points card. It's kind of surprising. Hey, um, Healy, send me, um, send me that uh, a picture if you can on email of that CPEC card, and I will ask somebody if they're interested in your price. I know a Viking fan that might be interested in it if uh, Zamil is not. Okay, let's random these real quick, and then I'll go. Uh, we're going three times on both of these. Generally, I just go three times on the smaller stuff and the giveaways. We had one dual insert card that had Chicago and Dallas, Walter Payton and Emmett Smith. I'm going to go three times. The team on top wins the card. One, two, three. Three times. The Bears. Walter beats Emmett. I'll move next. I have all 32 teams here in the random. I'm going to go three times. And whoever's on top after three times wins the old Panini points. If you don't think you're going to use the Panini points, please let me know and I'll trade you something for it. I don't have, I mean, I don't, I can't give a ton of value for it, but if it's just going to sit, uh, if you're just not going to use it, you might as well get something you like out of my eBay store or something. So that's always an option. Just let me know uh, soon. Let's see who wins it first. One, two, three. Tennessee Titans. Dave, you've been hot on those uh, randoms lately on this room on the hitting the top. At least on the giveaway ones you have, haven't you? <laughs> Tennessee. Three times. Let me know, Dave, if you're not going to use that, and I'll give you something else for it, or I'll give you some credit or something. If you do want it, I will send it to you. I don't know if you use them or not, if you're building up for something in there. They have some good cards, but it takes a lot of points. And that's the end of this break. Let me end the video here.